Uh, President, Commissioner, colleagues, on the 15th of December last year, I made a statement as the Chair of the Delegation for Relations with South Caucasus, expressing concern by the actions of the Azerbaijani state, state authorities and purported environmental protesters. I urged Azerbaijani authorities to end the blockade of the Lashin Corridor and fulfill its obligations under the trilateral statement of the 9th of November 2020. More than a month has passed and Azerbaijani inaction has led to a severe humanitarian crisis, including one death. 120,000 Armenians live under effective blockade. Hundreds of families remain separated People are deprived of essential goods and services. Children do not go to school. And recently, we witnessed a new wave of high-level inflammatory rhetoric, calling to discriminate against Armenians and urging them either to take Azerbaijani citizenship or to leave Nagorno-Karabakh. These statements are, and inaction are inappropriate for a state that considers itself EU's reliable partner. I urge Azerbaijani side to respect its international commitments, to end the blockade of the Lashin Corridor and humanitarian crisis, to provide unimpeded access of international organizations to Nagorno-Karabakh, and to start negotiations on comprehensive peace agreement that must guarantee all rights and security to Armenian population of Nagorno-Karabakh. I would like to thank the co-authors of the resolution and encourage the House to adopt this resolution unanimously. And finally, I would like to conclude on a personal note that address Azerbaijani officials who have started witch hunt against me personally. I want to tell you that you will neither frighten me nor silence me. Your attacks expose your weakness. You have gone below low, but I will not go low. I will follow Michelle Obama's example. When you go low, I go high. Thank you. Paldies. Nākamai vārts Natalija Lo.